A public golf course in Waterloo closed its doors after more than 60 years. The owner tells us it's because it became too expensive to run. 7 News reporter Chloe Salsameda tells you about the impact this place had on the community. The Rolling S Golf Club was first established in 1961, but its doors permanently closed over the weekend. The Rolling S Golf Club looks much different than it did last week. The flags are being taken down. A sign outside the course announces it's permanently closed due to the economic environment. The owner tells 7 News that costs have doubled and not as many people have been coming to the course, forcing his family to shut it down on Saturday. When people learned the course was closing, they made sure to get in one last round. We played all 18 holes for the last time Friday morning. Hitting the driver on the last hole was a bittersweet moment because we knew it was going to be our last time as a group there. Nathan Godfrey went to the course every week with his dad and two brothers. It's always been our kind of home golf course. We usually go play there every Sunday morning. We go as a family and uh, we're incredibly going to miss it. Godfrey says there was something special about the people his family would meet along the course. He hopes someone buys and reopens it because he says there aren't many public golf courses nearby. For, for where it was local to us, it was perfect. I'd love to see it continue to grow. I know that it has a great opportunity to. It's in a great location. So I'm hoping that somebody picks it up and, uh, and, and takes off with it. The owner of the golf course says anyone who is interested in buying the course can contact him. We'll have that information on our website. In Waterloo, Chloe Salsameda, 7 News.